हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज़ प्रियंका शर्मा एंड टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू गिव प्रेजेंटेशन ऑन द टॉपिक प्रोडक्शन टेक्नोलॉजी ऑफ ब्रिंजल बिफोर आई बिगिन आई वुड लाइक टू थैंक्स आर कोर्स इंस्ट्रक्टर डॉक्टर प्रशांत बख्शी सर फॉर गिविंग मी दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी कंटेंट्स ऑफ माई प्रेजेंटेशन आर इंट्रोडक्शन साइंटिफिक क्लासीफिकेशन इकनॉमिक इम्पोर्टेंस एंड यूजेज एरिया एंड प्रोडक्शन पॉपुलर वेराइटीज एंड हाइब्रिड्स क्लाइमेट सॉइल सोइंग टाइम नर्सरी प्रिपरेशन ऑफ लैंड स्पेसिंग न्यूट्रिशन इरीगेशन वीड कंट्रोल यूज ऑफ ग्रोथ रेगुलेटर्स एंड केमिकल्स हार्वेस्टिंग एंड यील्ड सीड प्रोडक्शन इंट्रोडक्शन ब्रिंजर और एग प्लांट इज एन इम्पॉर्टेंट क्रॉप ऑफ सब ट्रॉपिक्स एंड ट्रॉपिक्स The name of brinjal is popular in Indian subcontinents and is derived from Arabic and Sanskrit whereas the name eggplant has been derived from the shape of the fruit of same some varieties which are white and resemble in shape to chicken eggs Scientific classification Kingdom Plantae Order Solanales Family Solanaceae Genus Solanum species as melogena economic importance and uses it is an annual crop cultivated all over india the fruits are available practically throughout the year brinjal fruits are good source of calcium phosphorus iron and vitamins particularly b group analysis of 100 gram of edible fruit contains 91.5 gram of water 6.4 gram of carbohydrates 1.3 gram of protein 0.3 gram of fat and 0.5 of mineral matters its green leaves are the main source of vitamin c dark purple brinjal has more vitamin c than those white skin bitterness in brinjal is due to presence of glycoalkaloids generally high amount of glycoalkaloids produces a bitter taste and off flavor brinjal is reported to stimulate the intrapeptic metabolism of blood cholesterol dry fruit is reported to contain gyrogenic principles area and production in india it is well distributed in orissa bihar karnataka west bengal andhra pradesh and maharashtra and up brinjal covers 8.14% of total vegetable area and produces 9% of the total production popular varieties and hybrids long varieties pusa purple long It is a selection from a local variety Batia Pusa purple cluster This cultivar is resistant to bacterial wilt and little leaf disease Pusa kranti This cultivar is dwarf dwarf spreading habit fruits are oblong with attractive purple color This cultivar is good for both spring and autumn planting under north indian conditions The average yield varies from 25 to 30 ton per hectare. Arkashil the fruits are medium long with deep shining purple color. Arka kusumakar the finger shaped fruits are born in clusters. Arka anand it is a high yielding F1 hybrid with resistant resistance to bacterial wilt suitable for kharif and rabi other long varieties arka keshav arka navneet azad kranti round varieties pant rituraj resistant to bacterial wilt pusa purple round it is highly resistant to little leaf virus diseases other round varieties manjri krishnanagar purple round hybrid varieties pusa bhairav pusa kranti pusa anmol climate 
brinjal is susceptible to severe frost a long and warm growing season with temperature range of 21 to 27 degrees celsius is most favorable for its successful production climatic conditions especially low temperature during the cool season cause abnormal development of the ovary in flower buds which then differentiate and developed into deformed fruits during that season late cultivars however withstand mild frost and continue to bear some fruits soil the brinjal can be grown particularly on all soils from light sandy to heavy clay loam soils are good for an early crop while clay loam and silt loam are well suited for higher yield generally silt loam and clay loam soils are preferred for brinjal cultivation the soil should be deep fertile well drained the soil ph should not be more than 5.5 to 6.0 for its better growth and development sowing time raised beds 1 meter wide 4 to 5 meter long and 30 cm above the soil are prepared in the north east hill region conditions brinjal can be grown round the year the main sowing season being during july to august For a second crop of brinjal seeds are sown from March to April. Nursery raised beds should be prepared and seeds are grown in rows of 7.5 to 10 cm apart. The seeds should be covered properly by a mixture of FYM and soil. To avoid fungal diseases the seeds should be treated with captan or thyrum at the rate of 2 kg per 1 kg of seed. about 250 to 375 g seed is difficult to cover 1 hectare of land with 30000 to 45000 seedlings the seedlings are ready for transplanting in about 4 to 5 weeks preparation of land soil is prepared to fine tilth by giving 4 to 5 pluffings well rooted organic manure is incorporated into the soil well before the final preparation spacing 60 by 45 75 by 60 cm and 75 by 75 cm nutrition it is a heavy feeder of nutrients and requires more nutrients for better yield and quality fym requirements 25 ton per hectare nitrogen 100 kg per hectare phosphorus 60 kg per hectare potassium 60 kg per hectare basal dose half dose of nitrogen and full dose of phosphorus and potassium top dressing remaining dose of nitrogen is applied after 30 days irrigation it requires several irrigation for successful cultivation timely irrigation is essential for fruit set and its development usually the crop is irrigated weekly once for higher yield weed control it is essential to keep weeds under control from the initial growth itself 3 to 4 hoings are normally followed for effective control of weeds orobenche is one of the serious weed affecting solanaceous crops in some areas it is a root parasite and should be controlled effectively a pre planting treatment of 1.0 kg by hectare of flocculorin followed by one hand weeding at 30 days after transplanting is effective use of growth regulators and chemicals application of 2 4d at flowering induces parthenocarpy increases fruit set advances fruit maturation and significantly increases total yield naa alone or in combination with ba 
applied on open floors improved fruit set harvesting and yield harvesting and yield brinjal fruits are harvested when they have developed a good color and marketable size are still immature tender and have not lost culinary qualities early crop normally yields 20 to 30 ton per hectare while long duration crop yields 35 to 40 ton per hectare many f1 hybrids yields about 40 to 80 ton per hectare seed production an isolation distance of 100 to 200 meter for certified and foundation seed plots respectively should be maintained between two cultivars thank you